Hey, what's going on? My name's Arco. Welcome back to Metro Exodus. Can't get over this view. This view's dope. You look it's so cool. I gotta get back in here. Everybody's probably waiting on me. Anya nearly coughed up a freaking lung. Blood everywhere. They're still singing. I mean, I was supposed to go to the map the whole time. I can't say I've ever been religious. But right now I'm begging all gods. Please, watch over Anna. And make the valley cure her of her affliction. In the meantime, Alyosha and I are on a recon mission. We have no idea of what is waiting for us there. Though Alyosha seems convinced that there are going to be crowds of women eagerly anticipating his arrival. If that turns out to be the case, then I have the best companion possible for this mission. Yes, I must say, I'm rather partial to this valley. Take air for one. Makes your head swim. Never smelled air like this in my life. If we spend a week there, it won't just cure Anna. It'll make Colonel grow his feet back. Damn, this is one bumpy ride. I know. The rails are all bent. The whole track seems to be fixing to slide down. I sure hope it can hold our weight. Let's hail the Aurora and tell them to take the other road. Come in, Aurora. This is forward recon. Do you read? Over. Sir, this track won't hold the Aurora. Take the main one. Over. I see. This one requires some repairs. But this will hold us back. I got it. The plan stands. We're on the board, the dam. How is this general situation there? Over. The general situation is completely awesome, Colonel. Sir, Anna is sure to love it here. Over. So the plan goes like this. We get to that dam, check it out quickly, and call them over. Just take a look at all this beauty, huh? Don't you want them to see it sooner? Look at that church for me. Ah, oh, we just lost that car. The water was not rushing like that, though. Your friend, but I can see you're torn on bandits. 
I'll help you out if you don't do anything stupid. Gotta run now. Just stay out of sight and you'll be fine. Catch you later. Not like getting to a new place and nearly drowning. Where's my body at? He better not be dead. Are you kidding me? Let's cut the rope and take him to the camp with the first one. Hey, wait a minute. You pioneers already have one, and this is our catch. He got caught on our turf. The net is mine, so bite me. Oh, yeah? Well, why did you set the trap on our turf, then? Uh, besides, you already have an intruder's backpack. I dived for the backpack, and you chickened out. Oh, I chickened out? You're pirates! You have more boats! And this one will face the forest court. Bojumoy, you're all cowards. He's an intruder, an enemy. What are you, a bandit? What did the teacher say? He said we must be different. Did you forget? Uh, isn't your head getting a bit too big? The teacher said we have to defend ourselves first. All the rest was later. Did you forget what the intruders would do here? He's an intruder too, so he must die before he brings the others. Enough! The forest court comes first. The court will decide if we kill him. <laughs>
you got out, you asshole. It takes real skill to get away from the master of the forest. This means you're dangerous. Damn it. Fucking backpack. I got greedy. I got greedy. Well, shoot me. Or scram. I gotta get ready for the final exam. Tell the teacher. I defended ours. Didn't chicken out. Didn't bully the girls. Teacher. What do you think? He took a hit from the master. The master probably got Eugene too. You were in the camp, we came here. It all took time. So what? We must at least get the bodies back. We'd be called cowards if we don't. Yep. Let's push it then. Yeah. Just tell me one thing though. How did you guys manage not to see the master? He can walk silently. And we were distracted. Another intruder. Or at least the boots. Another intruder? Weird that Olga didn't say anything. And didn't even come with us. Ah, well, so where is he? He's still hanging out there. If the master didn't get him, well, no reason to hurry up then. Yeah, let's pick up his feet. Serious matter. By the way, did you already set one at the camp entrance? <coughs> sure thing, the first thing I did. How about the cave? What cave? Keep quiet. You summoned the council. What do you mean, what cave? The one behind the pond up the street. What is that supposed to be? You let an intruder go. You could go. meet the others here. He saw yet. all of our positions here. Nobody, nobody lets him go. He escaped. The guard was distracted. And he's being punished. Ha <laughs> Well, more intruders come and start cutting you to pieces. That's going to be a great help. You'll be running around pissing your pants and shouting, We punished the guard. Or maybe you'll just surrender. Running is your forte. You said you were going to go to London and drag. <laughs> I really hope this is the right side they were talking about. Where the heck is the dude at? Why am I even here?
Oh, I did that too soon. Spent all that time sneaking in here just to punch that guy in the face. I've had it with this voice. I've had it with going sneaky. I've had it with being nice. Drifter, if you're still human, that is. Retreat! That is you one, Drifter. I surrender, Drifter. I can't do anything anymore.
Was this where I had to go the whole time? You won, Britta. Nothing I could do about that. Where am I going? Just want to rescue my boy and get out of here. Great job, man. What do we do now? They're both out. Why just do the work yourself if you're so smart? I told you we should have just killed them. They aren't going to talk anymore. Kill them? Ever find hanging on one of their posts with wolves nibbling at your feet? They have a lot to answer for.
Ah, oh, great. I know I'm gonna have to fight this thing eventually. Of the forest. Oh, cool. How long until I see that bitch again?
freeze drifter so we meet again though i bet you don't remember who dragged you out of the water my name is olga by the way was it you fighting the master of the forest awesome our hunters had been staying away from him for years damn it sorry teacher the locks all rusted up Your friend Alyosha is already at the dam. He said your cardinal won't wait, so you don't have much time. Sorry, I can't take you there. At today's council session, the pirates moved to attack your train, but they had no right to even call one without me present. As usual, I need to go and sort this out. But I have a few minutes to give you some directions. You need a boat to get to the dam. And our pirates keep all the boats at their swamp camp. They are not the sharing kind, but that's no reason to attack. Nobody wants bloodshed, so just stay out of their sight. Take the road to the barricade. Go down to the swamp and find the dock. That's where Alosha and I took the boat from. Teacher, forgive me. There are some left, but be careful. Well, Drifter, take care. And don't make me sorry I helped you people. Tell Alyosha I said hi. I'll stay a bit longer to tend to the grave of the teacher. Neat. Decided to relax a bit before the trip. That's a good idea. So now I got any more sneaking. Yeah, another damn boat. Go fuck somebody up. Just to get to the dam. I'm so sick of all this being nice shit.
Oh, it's gonna be do some extra shit in this fucking guy. your tongue so you can't knock on the door anymore eh as the teacher said courtesy distinguishes us from bandits and other animals wait a moment you're not one of ours a bandit then don't look like one though you never know with them bandits different shit every day am i right or what senya you're always right admiral sir uh, put a sock in it. Your nose is brown enough. Well, ah, the bandit. Well, you're here. Which means that all those spineless worms and wannabe pirates are all dead. Am I right? Don't bother answering. Everyone knows I'm right. And good riddance, I say. Perhaps we should offer him our hospitality, Admiral, sir. He is a guest, even though he's a bandit. Ah, that's an idea. Take a seat, bandit. 
Let's have some tea. I bet you never tried anything quite like it. I gathered, dried, and brewed it myself. Can't get any help from this worthless lot. At least, they don't eat much. Hey, boys! Yeah! Trying our best, Admiral, sir! Ah, uh, quit your yapping. Making a worse racket than the damn aquas in heat. No respect for our guest, either. He can't get a word in edgewise. Don't mind them. To our meeting. That's a good tea. You fussy ground-loving rats don't drink it, though. Radiation! Radiation! Radiation, my ass! Radiation. Just look at us! Dangerous. We're all healthy as can be! <laughs> Thanks for coming here. See how happy my boys are? We don't really have anyone to talk to here anymore. They all left We're the all cowards. forgotten here. Even Roman forgot about us. Yet he was here with us when we built this base. All the boys remember that. Don't you now? Yes, he was here! I remember. We all remember. That's right, boys. You all remember. But that bastard just forgot. And the other ground-loving rats, too. They all forgot. We're protecting them all with our lives here. At first, they were so happy. They shouted, We'll kill all the bandits! The pioneers are cowards! The teacher is wrong! We're better off attacking! Didn't they, boys? Yeah, they did! They shouted their throats sore! Yeah, louder than those bandits we shot! There you have it. My boys do remember. And those don't. You could always count on them when you wanted someone to shout and call pioneers names. Aye, but when the going got tough and the Aquas started attacking in their hundreds, they changed their tune. Oh, radiation. Oh, it's dangerous. Oh, the girls say teacher told them to tell us that we have to get out. Well, fighting the Aquas ain't as fun as hanging bandits from the posts. You can rob the bandits when you kill them, but mutants don't have much worth taking. So who cares if they're about to eat the whole valley, right? Pathetic rats. That's who rats. they are. Ground-loving rats. A bit late to start listening to the teacher, too. Though, oh my goodness, are we done here? Yeah. They listen to be a teacher idea. Take a seat, bandit. Let's have some tea. I bet you never tried anything quite like it. Leaving already? Leave. You're just a rat like the rest of them. After all. And military to boot. Rats. Uh, you can't really expect to fight in any village for a... This game makes me racist.
Get some! Artyom? Damn, you're alive! I'm so glad to see you. And I just managed to get in contact with the Aurora. They are worried. And I get that. This place isn't as simple as it first seemed. Come, I'll show you. Let's go, Artyom. Hear the counter react? There's a hell of a lot of radioactive sediment behind that concrete. And soon, it'll bring an end to this valley. Because the dam barely holds. Use your binoculars if you don't believe me. We can't stay here. Nobody can, really. Ah, well, see that zipline? Those kids built it, back when there wasn't as much seepage. That's where we need to go. The old man said the Aurora will soon be on the dam. We gotta hurry! I think something's wrong at the Aurora. Great. You alive there? Huh? What the hell? Goddamn! Oh no.
Oh no, what the fuck? Restore this line's tension. We're done. Olga, this is Artyom, my friend. He's good too. He's a murderer, that friend of yours. Artyom, how could you? And you are They're a just... liar. I don't want to Shit. know you anymore. Olga, I'll be back. You'll be dead if you do. Artyom, let's go! Did you really kill them? Why? They're just like little kids, these guys! Why? Artyom... in bad shape. We must move. Time is short. Neither the air nor the drugs we found along the way are of any help now. And now Alyosha is wounded too. Come. What was I supposed to do? How was I not supposed to murder these people? We all remained silent while the Aurora was running along the poison sea held at bay by the dam. We believed we'd be back. Now, having seen the sword of Damocles hanging over the valley, we knew it was not meant to be. Alyosha, who is still unable to walk after being shot in the back, is driving himself mad with worry. His Olga is there. Perhaps he will be able to warn her via radio and save the people there. What happens next? I have no idea. I am ready for anything. Anything but one thing. Anna, please hold on. Without you, I have nothing to live for, nothing to dream about. Doubly so, since if not for that dream of mine, you'd be all right now. photo of the Pacific Ocean. I just knew for some reason that we were going to go there in the end. All these rivers, mountains, deserts, they just won't do. It's ocean or bust. I believed we could make it. I did. I know I'll get there, and if I need some help, you'll be there for me. You'll save me again, won't you? <coughs> Artyom, please, stop torturing yourself. It hurts to even look at you. You and Dad, too. It's not your dream, and not his belief in the occupying forces. It's just fate. A stupid piece of cloth in the wind. Rotten concrete. An idiotic ammo dump. <coughs> Atom, you should go. I'll give her a shot. Let her sleep a bit. Come 
Put me, Bratuha. There are things to discuss. Hey, leave your work for the moment. Come to the bridge. Well, we can discuss that in the next episode, too. Stepan, come to the. I will be on George's Hardy Day, and if you need for deeper, smash the like button, tell your friends. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't already, and this is becoming a train wreck. I don't know if we're gonna get the good ending, but whatever.